Hey, what's going on everybody? Uh, I'm just going to take a few minutes to talk to you a little bit about high fructose corn syrup. Um, I've strongly stated in the past that high fructose corn syrup should be avoided at all costs. And I'm talking in regards to a Men's Health Magazine article by uh, David Zinzenko with uh, Matt Goulding. It's called The 15 Biggest Nutrition Myths. I'm going to read a little bit from it. It's uh, myth number one, high fructose corn syrup is worse than table sugar. Whether or not added sugar is bad for you has never been in dispute. The less sugar you eat, the better. But whether HFCS, high fructose corn syrup, is worse than the plain, plain of table, old table sugar has long been a contentious I issue. Here's what you need to know, according to this article, is that they're both essentially the same chemically. And that means in all likelihood, according to this, your body can't tell the difference. But he goes on to say, it may be affecting your health in ways that is not yet fully understood by the scientific community. And this is kind of the piece de resistance, or the crudetat, or whatever you want to throw in for the adage, of the philosophy of from the sun to you. You need basically to be a chemist in order to make high fructose corn syrup. And while table sugar is processed, we should be making steps towards sugar in the raw and less processed goods instead of steps towards high fructose corn syrup. It's a good just rule of thumb. If high fructose corn syrup is in something, judge it as, in, as an unhealthy treat and then indulge in it and know that you're doing something unhealthy. Don't ever, ever, ever settle for high fructose corn syrup in the staples of your diet like bread, peanut butter, or anything like that. If you indulge in it every once in a while, what's the big deal? Sure. But in general, avoid it. It's an unhealthy thing and it shouldn't be looked at just because it's chemically the same as table sugar. High fructose corn syrup, we're on to you.